All right, for today's video, we're shooting at a different location because the range was packed with people today. So that just wasn't going to work. So I'm out here on a chunk of Forest Service land. We're going to be shooting the 180 grain trophy bonded tips from Federal. Uh, 30 caliber out of a 300 PRC and then a reduced load simulated long range. I'm going to start with that reduced load. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it well here. That bullet came in, then started to veer, came out the side of my gel block there. That sun's going to highlight this beautifully. Yeah, it veered a little bit, but that did an amazing job. Gorgeous permanent lung cavity. And it was going 1,500. 33 feet per second so definitely longer range shots lower velocity that bullet's going to perform like we would want it to usually i get so much penetration from those is why i put these extra blocks up here and it had a beer on me you know, good old murphy's law for that high velocity. I do. Look you there. Good thing I had that third block there. Over 30 inches of penetration. I am going to have to shoot another one through the chronograph because I got an air reading on that one for some reason.
second full load went through that chronograph and I brought the chronograph up here closer rather than walking back and forth. 3156. So that one that impacted the gel would probably be you know, between 31 3200 feet per second. I usually don't have more than 15 20 feet per second deviations on most of those. But I'd have to say definitely dumped good energy without just over grenade and destroying that first block still giving over 30 inches of penetration yet on a low velocity even where it exited the gel you're running over 18 a lot of times these ones on my low velocities will go clean through too easy and I tend to catch them in the third one is why I started using these old blocks for just catching bullets but uh, Overall, it's just hard to be, beat that kind of performance. That low velocity is still a wicked, nasty wound channel in there. And yet that high velocity did its job incredibly well. Just tearing up those blocks. So I'll do a little more in-depth overview of these blocks when I get home. But I'd have to say out of all the different bullets I've been testing, these trophy bonded tips just seem to be the most impressive of, they uh, they don't over grenade at high velocities. Um, which a lot of the bullets that I test over grenade and under penetrate when you hit that gel at anything over 3,000 feet per second. So extremely happy with them there, but you can get down under 1600 feet per second and still get that kind of performance I'm not sure there's a better bullet on the market. They have just performed so incredibly well for me out of every test I've put them through um, Definitely the most impressive bullets I've tested so far Hope you guys enjoy this video